said the fucking question correctly because otherwise you're spinning it. Don't spin with me, okay? But who are you? Oh, Ryan. Could you take that away from me? Oh, no, it's a 60 year old sign. Sorry. <laughs> In my last video, I did get a lot of flack for interviewing people outside. So now I've just chose to sit in my bed 24 hours a day. I won't be moving unless... Hello? Donald Trump. I couldn't believe what I was hearing. I've only lived in America for five months and already I was getting a call from the president? You need me to do street interviews to save the country. You have something that's uh, incredible and special. Like just because I had sex with like 10,000 men or right, whatever, it doesn't make them gay. Just pull my trusty interview stick from under the bed. Just cover it in a little bit of poo from pleasuring my ass with it. But most importantly, I wanted to use my new platform to end racism. Get a job. I do like to see New York come together and everyone in the city's been wearing uh, Chinese people masks in solidarity with the Chinese. So if you're watching this and you're racist or homophobic and transphobic, you can just fuck the fuck off. Do you think it's racist and sexist that uh, Tiger King only had like white people in it? Yeah, I think that's racist. Do you think that they should have had more people getting killed by the tigers of different races and ethnicities? Yeah. That means they should close it for racism or sue their ass for racism. Racism makes me so fucking... Ah! How long have you been wearing the mouth yarmulke for? Ever since uh, everybody started wearing masks. What do you think about de Blasio saying that women need to be in the kitchen now? I don't know what life he led, you know, as a kid. Maybe you know, he's just uh, old fashioned, so that's how he sees it. You know, he doesn't necessarily agree that they should be voting and all this sort of stuff. He thinks they should be in the kitchen making sandwiches for their husband. Not just in the kitchen. You're saying if they want to go uh, in the bathroom to like wipe off after sex, that's fine too, but. Yeah, stay in the house. Well, oh, you mean Corona, the drink or the virus? The virus. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's, a, it's a great, so much to think about, so much to ponder here. What do you like better, Corona, the drink or Corona, the virus? That, that goes without saying. The Some virus. questions pretty the much virus. answer themselves. <laughs> <laughs> so, because I, I don't believe there is a coronavirus. You're saying the government's lying to everyone. Yeah, the government is. The government's official position is it's, it's Doggy a Doggy style. Well, do you think coronavirus is another hoax, just like 9-11, or the fact that a man's ass isn't tasty? All, all, the, the... Lesbianism, or the fact that the three-inch penis is actually small? 9-11 is a hoax. Yeah, 9-11's a hoax, that's and, what I said. The and, myth of the three-inch penis, they don't make them that big, I said. Oh, I didn't know that, actually. No, they don't, I they didn't. don't actually make them that big, that's a lie. What are you packing, uh, penis-wise? Uh, uh, <laughs> I think I better go. And what does it taste like? <laughs> Have you seen any people uh, selling dildos in the area? Are these cum regs or what are they? What would you say to people who are at home right now and their girlfriends letting themselves go and getting sort of fat? A lot of people is gonna gain weight, which they shouldn't. What should I say to my girlfriend though if she's sitting at home just stuffing her fat face? You gotta moderate what you eat. It Do you might... think I should put locks on the cupboards or anything like that? Nah, that's not a good thing. You know why? Why? Because then now you'll want to starve people. Yeah, that's what I want to do, starve her. I've been giving her pamphlets about like bulimia and anorexia and why it's pretty good and stuff like that. No, no, that's not good. Oh, it's better than the alternative of me having sex with a really disgusting person. <laughs> Eating food and then spitting it back up, like it's not good. I'd prefer if she ate it and spit it back out because if she eats it and processes it, then it's causing flap under the arm and stuff like that. It's not a good thing either. And then when we have sex, I basically just find like a crevice in her body. I'm sorry for laughing, but I've been through that. You've been through that too. But it's like hard. I'm living with bone cancer and I'm this slim. Do you get that from boning too much? Yeah. What's the best flap you find if you were to have sex with a morbid, like in a morbidly obese woman like that? I really wouldn't say it, but. Come on, you know what the best flap is to have sex with a morbidly obese woman. Back flap or? It's hard to eat your life away. You can't keep eating. Cause I was thinking maybe if I rolled her around the apartment, that might. <laughs> Nah, don't roll around the apartment. Maybe put like her on a treadmill and then have like the hot dog on a string at the... You can't do that like that. Cause she eventually gonna wanna eat more. Do you have any advice you could say to her to camera? Yeah, stop eating, like, that's gonna kill you. It's not a good thing to eat all this food. You gotta manage. And tell her that the food costs money if you don't mind. And the food costs a lot of money. Not gonna get the business. <laughs> I thought, for a second, I thought you were my girlfriend. It's nothing. Sorry, my bad. Excuse me, have you ever seen any prostitutes around here? It's looking to get a little fix, you know what I'm saying? I don't know. I preferably am looking for a girl prostitute, but if you see like a man, like whatever, it's, you I know. I don't know, I don't know. Maybe in the park, but I'm not sure. We're looking to get some sniz? Sniz. Or if you have a connection for any bitches? No. No. 
I heard that the Chinese were developing a cure, but it would only work on Chinese people. That's because crazy. it. No, it's true because it's administered in through the penis, and it can only travel four inches. So if it, the cure starts to disintegrate at the fifth inch, so it only works on Chinese people. Oh no! How's the coronavirus been affecting the selling the junk on the street? Excuse me. Can you please Six feet away. I know. Back away. Uh, all the way off. We have presidential per uh, permission to be out here, but... Um, with my mind, I created that shit. You created the hitting the guy with the bus? I'll tell you why. There's this homeless girl, and I told her, I said, I'd give you $6,666 if you'd be my slave for 24 hours. What you would know? you get her to do if she was your slave? Whatever the fuck I want. What would that be? What kind of thing Everything. Would you want? Get on your knees. What would she do when Do she was on her knees? Suck some dicks. Piss in my golden goblet and make her drink it. Then I'll take her shit and make her eat it. But how did that relate to the bus thing again? Because she was saying no. And my mind just went zing. And zing. Boom. I got her on tape. As he's as the blood is coming out of the top of his head. Yo, bro, I need you in my red guard. Hold on. What's your name? Theo. Theo, I'm gonna change your name. Right Would you be interested in being a slave or you have to eat the shit and uh, suck the dicks and stuff? <laughs> no, this job is to help me collect souls. He so he collects people that piss and shit in the goblet. Right. How do you feel about that new position? I don't know. You do Who's the people in your uh, regiment, uh, so to speak, that uh, have to be on all fours and suck the dick and eat your shit? The people's the pieces of shit. How many people do you have working under you right now that are eating the shit and uh, drinking no, your piss and all that stuff? They don't work under me. They're pieces of shit. I just want their souls. That guy over there said that it was one of his slaves that did it, and then he made the bus come with his mind. Apparently, that's what he said. He was like a mind control thing, and he said that he shits and pisses and makes people drink it and eat it and stuff like that too. So. I don't know if you want to corroborate that. Excuse me? Guys. Not right now. <laughs> <laughs> you heard that coronavirus makes have like um, discharge out of the penis and like uh, hurts when you pee and stuff like that? I have not heard that. Because I was pretty it. sure me and my girl both had uh, coronavirus because we had the bumps and the discharge and everything. I, whatever. No, that sounds like uh, genital warts. Well, could I show you and you could diagnose it or uh, not? I, that's kind of inappropriate. What is this for, anyway? Oh, it's for Vice Magazine. Who? A Vice Magazine. Oh, nice. Let me ask you a question. When you were fingering Stormy Daniels, did any of your boys smell your fingers or did you just keep it all for yourself? Nice. So how long have you been doing it? For, I've been doing this for about three, four months and then the president called and it was like this whole... Oh, that's pretty cool. Yeah. Cool. Hey guys, do you see any working girls around here? What's number for a prostitute? You have a number for a prostitute? Male or female? Female? Yeah. <laughs> female. This Corona stuff's crazy, eh? Like, is it a virus? Is it a flu? It's... Apparently it uh, came from China. That's what I've been hearing. Yeah. It's the beat on the street. What are you doing later? I'm sorry? What? <laughs> Gonna check out the gym quickly here. It's closed up, so that's bad news for all your fat ass moms. <laughs>